Welcome to episode three of RBS number three. RBS 3 is a rolling ball sculpture where the balls roll from the top of my sculpture down to the bottom using gravity alone and following a path that I will make using copper tracks. Now once the balls get to the bottom they need to be lifted back up to the top and I'm going to use an electric motor for that. Today's episode we'll see all the wires embedded into the bottom of the base so that keeps them safe, they can't be seen and basically it's nice and pretty. Once all that's done, there'll be a metal plate underneath to keep it all hidden. Enjoy the episode. I'll see you at the end. Let's get soldering. Before I begin the rest of the soldering, I need to make a wiring diagram to make sure that I get everything right first time. Now I've got my plan, I can get on with the soldering.
that's the first stage done. Done all the switches and the control knob and the positive wire that goes into the step down. Next I'll do the leads that go into the speed controller and all the zero volts that need to be connected. Um, probably going to put that on there and connect it in that way and then use a screw down through the middle to keep it all still. So everything's nice and tidy, cable tied down, this keeps everything from moving about, the screws are in nice and tight, uh, it's all sub flush inside the pocket, which means that when the lid goes on, there will be, uh, none of the wires will be actually touching the lid. This is all nicely cable tied in at both ends, USBs are there ready for whatever they're going to be used for in the future, and this is all nicely cable tied in as well to keep it nice and secure. I did add a connector block, which will make it easier for replacing the motor wires if ever that needs to happen. Um, so these two wires here come out and go up the hole to the motor, the green and the black. Um, but apart from that, it's all done. Uh, I just need to now put the, put the lid on, secure it down, and it will probably never be seen again. Okay, time for the test. I've got my um, power supply. It goes in the back. I've uh, got the motor already wired in. And let's give it a little go. So it's hard to see on camera, but that's spinning. That's fully, fully fast, <laughs> maximum speed. Slightly slower. And all the way down to stop. Switch for the motor. And the switch for the USB. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave comments down below. If you want to see next week's episode, subscribe. If you're watching this from the future and you've come back to see the beginning, then welcome. It isn't made yet. We're in April 2021 and I'm blogging this weekly as we go. Next week's episode, I think, will be when I fit the motor to the baseboard and actually start to build from the ground up. So today's episode completes the foundation work from now on there's visible things to see on the way up. So, see you next week. Bye bye.